this video just kind of goes through the key differences uh, in the layout, look and feel, and technological differences between Spire and Business Vision. So first of all, in Spire, everything's by a list view. So all columns can be clicked on and sorted. So instead of being put into a new screen like you do with Business Vision, uh, and then you go look up an order that's in the system, we put everything in a list. Therefore, you can sort by any one of these columns, of course, move any column where you want, and be able to export this data by clicking on the export button after first selecting a filter for what you want. So giving you that capability reduces the need for a lot of reports because on screen with filters, searches, and exports, you can do a lot of that by customizing them yourselves. Another major difference is you'll find a reports button inside of every module. So if I'm inside of accounts payable, I have a reports button. If I'm in customers, I have a reports button. Purchase orders, I have a reports button. We don't make you go to a reports module. You won't see a reports module on, on the list. There is actually a run reports button here for anything that doesn't fit inside of a module. but Wherever there is a module, there is also a reports button, and therefore the reports that go along with that are all listed when you click that button. So any report that's in this module show up here, and a report from this module will show up in here, and so on. So, and you can add in custom reports to those buttons as well. Another major difference is that when you are in a module, and you are, for instance, in the sales here, you can see information from within the program, everywhere in the program. So you don't have to close this module or even this, this actual sales order in this case to find other information. If I'm on inventory here, for instance, it's showing me for this item all of the balances and on order information there on that item. If I click that item, I get the same. And then if you do need more information, you can go look up on the inventory item and actually hit the edit on the fly and there you see everything about this item, the sales history for it, its purchase history for it, open sales order for it, statistics for it, all that information inside the module you are working on. So we ne every time you can see the data, we allow you to use the data. So for instance, if I look at the sales orders here, this is all open sales order for this customer. You can see those open sales orders. You can double click on it. You can actually go in here and work on this particular sales order process process it or invoice it anywhere you need to from here. So we, we don't make you go elsewhere once you find information uh, inside of a module. It's done from there. So if I click on the customer lookup and I'm on the customer and I click the edit button and I want to see the account receivable for this customer, I simply click account receivable and I am here. I can take a payment from this customer from here if I wish. So if a customer comes in, I'm working on an order for them and they want to give me a payment, I simply go into the account seal module, take the payment, click the payment button, process the payment, post it, and I've done that inside the sales order module. And we give that to you everywhere. Same thing as in, in the account receivable module. If I go into an item here and I want to see something about this customer, I'm doing some collections here, I can click open customer. It opens a customer module. I see his sales history and everything else. So again, we allow you to do everything from the module you're in without having to open and close everything. The next difference is if I open up account receivable on a customer, I can double click and I can open up another customer. So I can switch between them very easily. And I go down to the bottom and I open up my screen. I can switch between the two of them here too. Or if I want to move that aside for a moment, I can go to my sales module, open up a sales order, work on this sales order. Maybe I get a call from a customer. I can go down to another sales order, open up that sales order, and have them all open at the same time. And by simply selecting them off the Windows list, I can switch between them. Very simply, very easily, window to window between each module and, and records within the module. So those are some of the key differences between Spire and Business Vision. Uh, being a more modern uh, visually more modern than, than Business Vision is. We allow you to do things easier, and we allow you to get at data much easier, 
uh, and the structure of the data itself is uh, very, very quick. It's a very uh, good database uh, to be able to use for large companies and for large data sets uh, while retaining all of its speed as well. So technologically, it'll take you a lot further and longer in your business cycle as you grow and need to add um, more users and, and your database grows larger and larger. And we strive to make sure that you don't have to outgrow Spire and move on to a different software uh, in the future. 